People often imagine that true freedom means owning a big solid piece of land somewhere far away from cities. But what if the house itself became the foundation of your freedom? What if the walls, the roof, and even the closets work together like a small ecosystem that keeps you alive, comfortable, and independent? When energy, water, air, and climate are all handled quietly inside the structure, the need for pipes, thick power lines, and expensive outside system starts to feel old and unnecessary. A wall that breathes, stores, lights, and organizes, a closet that dries clothes without heat, a skylight that brings in daylight while generating power, each tiny detail pushes you closer to a life where the house supports you instead of you supporting the house. And if all of these are arranged by Tesla into one unified interior system inside the upcoming 2026 Tesla Tiny House, then living freely, anywhere, desert, forest, or hillside, is not a distant dream. It becomes a plan already taking shape. Before we go deeper, tap the subscribe button to Future Drive Hub. Turn on notifications so you never miss the next part. Inside this house, one built-in feature works in silence to reduce mold, stop odors, and save precious space without needing bulky machines. The adaptive wall is a compact two-layer structure with a hidden air cavity that runs all the way from floor to ceiling. The front layer is made from moisture-resistant engineered wood or composite panels, smooth and minimal. Behind it, the rear layer contains an active insulation membrane equipped with small temperature and humidity sensors. The cavity in between is around 20 to 30 millimeters deep and creates slow, controlled airflow. A soft vertical LED strip hides inside the wall shifting color temperature from a warm 2,700 Kelvin at night to a brighter 4,000 or even 5,000 Kelvin during the day, gently supporting a natural circadian rhythm. And the smooth surface hides 7 to 10 centimeter storage channels for small items, keeping the 20 square meter Tesla tiny house neat, open, and visually calm. When the air inside heats up or humidity climbs because of sunlight or cooking, the sensors activate a small fan that moves 40 to 80 cubic meters of air per hour. Inside the cavity, the airflow stays at around 0.2 to 0.4 meters per second, which prevents any feeling of draft. The wall's materials naturally absorb and release heat and moisture, keeping the room stable. This reduces temperature peaks by about 1.5 to 2.5 degrees Celsius and keeps humidity around 45 to 55% which is the ideal comfort range for most people. Everything works quietly, under 28 dB at a meter away, low enough that you barely notice it. In real-world use, this microclimate control cuts cooling needs significantly. In an 18 to 22 square meters area, reducing peak temperature by around 2 degrees Celsius and stabilizing humidity can reduce the daily operation of a 500 to 900 watt mini air conditioner by 2 to 4 hours. That equals 1 to 3 kilowatt hours saved every day. Meanwhile, the wall system itself uses only 8 to 20 watts, about 0.16 kilowatt hours for 8 hours, meaning it pays back its own energy use many times over. Designed especially for remote locations, the whole system runs on 48 volt DC from a home battery and requires no thick walls or air ducts. With roughly 5 hours of usable sunlight, a 150 to 200 watt solar panel can power the sensors, fans, and LEDs. This makes the adaptive wall a perfect fit for off-grid lifestyles, echoing Tesla's vision for the 2026 tiny house. The health benefits come naturally. Maintaining around 50% humidity reduces mold, slows dust mite growth, prevents wood decay, and even helps protect electronics. A thin activated carbon layer absorbs smells from cooking or clothes. And the soft wall lighting avoids sharp shadows, making the compact space feel breezy, open, and clean. Even people who don't understand the engineering will feel it the moment they step inside. Fresh air, soft light, dry surfaces, and a calm atmosphere. Which part of the adaptive wall matters most to you? A. Lower energy use. B. Steadier temperature and humidity. C. Cleaner air and fewer odors. Reply with A, B, or C and share why. Now let's move to another hidden innovation, the Aero Closet Stack. This feature is surprisingly simple but incredibly helpful, making garments feel fresher and cleaner without using heat. 
the Tesla tiny house includes a 40 to 45 centimeters deep, built-in wardrobe with a sleek shadowline finish. Behind the smooth door hides a vertical airflow duct that goes from the bottom to the top. Air flows upward through three internal stages, fine dust filtration, odor removal using activated carbon, and moisture absorption using a replaceable dehumidification cassette. After treatment, the dry, clean air moves through the clothes hanging inside before exiting through a vent at the top. With all the mechanisms hidden, the closet looks minimal and seamless, exactly the Tesla interior style. Daily operation feels automatic. A small ultra-quiet fan, using power similar to a small LED bulb, runs every few minutes. Noise stays under 25 dB, basically silent even at night. The dehumidifier cassette contains 1 to 2 kilograms of silica gel or zeolite and absorbs around 200 to 600 grams of moisture in a cycle, enough to dry laundry for one or two people overnight. When the door closes, a UVC lamp turns on for five minutes to sterilize fabrics and eliminate bacteria. It shuts off automatically when the door unlocks for safety. Thin clothes dry in around three to four hours, while heavier garments take about six to seven hours. People simply hang clothes at night and find them dry, fresh, and odor-free in the morning. A hidden condensation tray collects water which then evaporates naturally, no drain pipe needed. That's why this system can be installed anywhere inside the tiny house layout. And when it comes to energy, the difference is huge. A normal tumble dryer uses 1 to 2 kilowatt hours per cycle. The aero closet stack running for 8 hours uses only about 0.06 to 0.12 kilowatt hours, 20 times less. A single 150 to 200 watt solar panel can fully power its fan, sensors, and UV lamp. This efficiency fits perfectly into Tesla's off-grid philosophy and supports the free land, lifestyle many dream of. Now, how does a tiny house keep a comfy bed while still feeling spacious? Tesla's solution is a ceiling-mounted loft capsule that raises and lowers smoothly to free valuable floor space. Its lightweight alloy frame holds 250 to 300 kilograms, with a 10 to 12 centimeters mattress, fitting ceilings 2.4 to 2.6 meters high. Each lift takes just 10 to 15 seconds. Peak power is 120 to 180 watts, but since it runs only briefly each day, total daily energy use stays below 0.05 kilowatt hours. Noise stays under 30 dB, quiet enough for peaceful nights. The capsule includes ambient lighting and air control. The soft arch light shifts from warm 2,700 Kelvin at night to 4,000 Kelvin in the morning, providing comfortable brightness of 100 to 150 lux for reading. CO2 and humidity sensors run a built-in fan moving 30 to 60 cubic meters of air per hour, keeping CO2 under 1,000 ppm and humidity in the 45 to 55 percent comfort zone. Airflow stays gentle at around 0.1 to 0.2 meters per second. A small insulated skylight with a reflective shade brings daylight with a U-value around 1.6 W slash M superscript 2K. When the 140 by 200 centimeters bed rises into its ceiling pocket, it frees around 2.8 square meters, about 14% of the entire living area. That floor space becomes a workspace, dining corner, or exercise area by day. Because the lifted bed reduces the volume of air that needs cooling or heating, energy use improves. Temperature set points can be raised by 0.5 to 1 degree Celsius while staying comfortable, saving roughly 0.3 to 0.8 kilowatt hours per summer day, far more than the motor consumes. Working together with the adaptive wall and aero closet stack, the loft capsule creates a stable, clean, breathable interior environment. The next question, will a tiny house give you natural light or leave you in artificial lighting? Tesla solves this using the Skylight Power Bay, a semi-transparent photovoltaic skylight with dual purpose. The glass lets in 30 to 50 percent of sunlight, while generating energy at 12 to 18 percent efficiency. With a surface area of 1.2 to 1.5 square meters, it produces around 120 to 220 watts at noon, enough to power LEDs, charge a small 150 to 300 WH buffer battery and run low-speed fans. 
light enters through a reflective light tube and an LED ring around the frame. On sunny days, desk level brightness stays between 250 and 400 lux. On cloudy days it remains above 150 lux. During rain or dark hours, the LED ring simulates daylight with 4,000 to 5,000 Kelvin during daytime and warm 2,700 to 3,000 Kelvin at night. The dual-pane glass has a U-value of 1.4 to 1.8 W-M superscript 2K and a solar heat gain coefficient of 0.35 to 0.45, with low coating and a hidden honeycomb shade for hot days. Lowering the shade and boosting roof airflow under intense sunlight reduces ceiling temperature by 2 to 3 degrees Celsius, easing the load on cooling systems. With 5 hours of good sunlight, the skylight generates around 0.6 to 1 kilowatt hour per day, enough to run lighting for 8 to 12 hours. LEDs consume only 6 to 12 watts for ambient light and 15 to 25 watts for reading. The system can run off-grid while keeping the house bright and comfortable. Maintenance is straightforward. Aluminum frame with double gaskets, built-in rain channels, LED lifespan of 30,000 to 50,000 hours, washable roof fan filters, and solar glass that keeps over 80% output after 20 to 25 years. All maintenance can be done from inside. No risky roof climbing. Now, can this tiny house switch layouts, or is it stuck as a one-purpose room? The answer is Tesla's moving backbone a hidden rail system along the walls and ceiling. The rails, made of lightweight extruded aluminum, are covered with slim 12 to 18 mm panels. Sliders with sealed ball bearings glide smoothly with very low friction, under 0.05. Each slider holds 25 to 40 kg, and paired sliders can support 60 to 80 kg for heavier modules. Daily use feels smooth and natural. Shelves, curtains, acoustic panels, Fold-out desks or kitchen modules attach with quick mount plates. Wall rails span 2.4 to 3.0 meters, and ceiling rails span 2.0 to 2.4 meters. Repositioning a module takes just 10 to 20 seconds. A morning workspace can become a dining corner and then a sleeping area at night. No tools needed. This flexibility increases usable floor space dramatically. A 60 by 120 centimeters fold-out table stores into just 0.07 square meters. When in use it extends to 1.2 to 1.5 meters, and sliding it away instantly frees 1 to 1.4 square meters. With the loft, bed, and rail system combined, 70 to 75 percent of the floor stays clear most of the day. This improves airflow, lighting, and the overall feeling of spaciousness inside the 20 square meters area. Durability and safety match the flexibility. Sliders are rated for 30,000 to 50,000 cycles, which equals 8 to 10 years of heavy daily reconfiguration. Dual locking pins prevent shaking or accidental movement. Rail covers can be removed for quick cleaning. Mounting bolts secure tightly into studs with a safety margin of 2.5 times the rated load. Because the rails are fully mechanical, they use no electricity to move. Only attached accessories like LED strips or socket modules draw power. With fewer fixed furniture pieces, maintenance costs drop and visual clutter disappears. A single worktop doubles as a dining table. An acoustic curtain becomes a privacy screen. Every element becomes multipurpose, dynamic, and quiet. What stays with you after all the engineering numbers is how effortlessly the Tesla tiny house turns light, air, and space into a calm routine. Daylight flows from the roof, producing the energy you need. The adaptive wall stabilizes heat and humidity while hiding clutter. Clothes dry while you sleep. The bed rises to free the floor each morning. The rails let the room shift from studio to lunch spot to rest zone without stress. It doesn't feel like a gadget. It feels like a home designed to give you freedom wherever you place it, on real ground, your terms, your space. If this vision inspires you, tap subscribe to Future Drive Hub and turn on notifications for more deep, realistic analyses of the technologies shaping the next era of living.